Hey, hey, hey everyone, my name is Nolan, and welcome back to another episode inside of the Calamity Mod. And fun fact, I'd actually already started recording this episode and realized that my mic was not, like, plugged in all the way, so the audio quality was horrible. But luckily, I hadn't made any progress. All I did was try out Providence, and yeah, that's literally it. I didn't beat it, of course. <laughs> so yeah, um, we're going to start off this episode by crafting some accessories that I think will be cool for this fight. So the first one is actually kind of an upgrade to the Sorcerer's Emblem. It's called the Void of Calamity, I'm pretty sure. This right here, the Void of Extinction. And all I need is an Obsidian Rose, which I can buy from this dude up here. So yeah, basically, today, guys, we are just going... Oh, I just bought, bought the wrong accessory. Okay. Yeah, today we are going to be taking down Providence. That is the goal. And, of course, my allergies are still bad. But we could craft the Void of Extinction. So it just does 50% increased damage, um, drops Brimstone Fireballs from the sky occasionally, and brimstone fire rains down while invincibility is active. So another thing I wanted to make is the heart of the elements, which I'm pretty sure I can make right now. Yeah, I did go and get all the uh, things for this, so I can craft this, boom, just like that. Okay, so I think that for now, I'm actually going to replace it with this thing right here. Even though I do think that this is pretty good. I don't know, I just wanted to try out the Heart of the Elements, and yeah, as you guys can see, it just summons all these elementals in that can fight for me. So yeah, we're going to reforge uh, these accessories now, just like this. We want Menacing, of course. Come on, Menacing, there we go. I'm going to spend all the gold that I got today. Okay, um, this one, yeah. Reforge, Reforge, Menacing, yes, okay. So now, um, I did craft the spawn for that, uh, in the thing that I had already recorded. So yeah, all I have to do is, actually, I'm gonna grab, I'm not gonna use any of these buffs. I'm gonna grab a Calamity, like, there's like a Calamity combination that the dude up here sells. Uh, it's you. You sell it. He sells a universal combination. I think that's it. I think that this, this is it. So I think I want this one. And I also want this one. I want both of them. I just spent, like, a whole platinum on potions. <laughs> but I want to beat this boss, bro. I want to beat it. Also, um, one thing I forgot to mention is that I am fighting it first in the underworld. Because I think it'll be easiest. Oh, guys, I forgot. There are also a couple weapons I wanted to make. So, I want to first make the Genesis. Um, this one was one that I think I could have made a while ago, but I just didn't make it because I didn't know how good it was. But this one is recommended for this fight. So, we'll replace it with that one. And then also, the Ultra Liquidator. I, I don't think I can make that, but I think I have all the ingredients for it. Ultra Liquidator. Oh, I can make it. Nice. Okay. Cool. So we'll use this too. And I'm going to... Uh, I think I'm going to keep all the other weapons and just add the Ultra Liquidator. Because I think that this is just mainly to like inflict the Ikor debuff. I don't really know though. So we're going to reforge these really quick. Although Deadly is good. Uh, we can do better. Mythical, yes. <laughs> just got, spent 56 gold, are you kidding me? How much is this gonna be? Masterful? We can go mythical, why not? Okay, cool, let's go fight this boss now. Alright guys, we're here, so buff up, and we'll take this, and we'll get this fight going. So I'm gonna start, yeah, with the Genesis here, and um, one thing that uh, I have to remember, oh, I forgot to set up a platform, gosh dang it, um, is that this Genesis, or the boss, sorry, the boss, does not t do contact damage, so I can run right into it, and it's really hard to see here. What exactly is a threat? <laughs> oh, what is going on? Okay, wait. Okay, I, I can't get hit by any of these, and I'm getting hit by, like, every single one. Holy cow. <laughs> what? What just happened? Okay. What? That was not like the fight yesterday. Oh my gosh. Like what? How am I supposed to dodge all this? I don't get it. It was not this hard yesterday. Something changed and I don't know what. Oh my gosh. I can't hit the green ones. Yes. Okay, well then I took damage. What? What is this fight, bro? Oh my gosh! What? I'm already almost dead. Why? Why is it pink now? <laughs> Why is it pink now? <laughs> Why? Why are the attacks blue? 
What is this? What? Okay, buff up. Summon it in. Let's go before all the... You gotta be kidding me. I was gonna say before all the monsters came in, but they're already here. Like, what? What are all these particles, bro? I don't get it. I don't get it. I, I truly do, don't know. I, I'm, I'm at a loss for words right now. Okay, I'm just gonna try it in the daytime in the hallowed biome, and hopefully this arena is big enough. I'm assuming it's gonna be. Like, what? There's just... What is that? That does not happen in the underworld. I'm gonna die, but this was definitely way better. What? What? No. No way. No way. How? <laughs> Tell me how this fight is possible. That's literally the only good... What? What? I'm gonna cry. What? So guys, I basically just spent some time making this arena, which is just a giant arena filled with actuated pearl, pearl stone blocks, because a lot of the guides I watched were just this. So I'm assuming it gets enraged when I take it out of biome. Okay, really quick guys, I just wanted to make an upgrade to the biome blade that I can make right now, and it's, it's just the true biome blade. So I think I have all the ingredients for it. Let's see here, true biome blade. Where are you? Right here. Yeah, okay, so I just need to deposit this, boom, and we should be able to craft it. So, let's see here. Why can't I? Um, oh, I need a I need a Core of Calamity, so I'll make that really quick. Hopefully I can. Core of Calamity, yes, I can make it, okay. Now, True Biome Blade. True Biome Blade, cool. And this does have an upgrade later on, but I need to, like, do some key binding really quick, because there is a lot to look... <laughs> To like look at this yeah okay so it's just a regular sword but it's got a lot of things to read so let's go up here so true biome blade um it does nothing yet it seems that upgrading the blade expanded the scope of the previous attunements your secondary attunement can now provide mass or passive bonuses holding down r and b for two seconds attunes the weapon to the powers of the surrounding biome using r and b for a shorter period of time switches your active Okay, so I definitely need to attune this really quick, and I'm going to do... I'm actually going to look into this really quick and see which attunements I should do. Okay, so I think that the uh, passive things are only for... Wow. <laughs> I, I think they're only for the specific biomes, so I'm just going to like go to random biomes and see like if I can like just find which ones that I want. So like for the corruption biome right here, um, is it still going to be like the dash that I had? Oh no, so this is like the one I had in the desert. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, so this is the ice biome one. Holy cow. What, what even is melee anymore? What, what is this? Bro. Jeez. Yeah, but I guess now I just have to try and fight this boss again. So, yeah, this will be interesting. Okay, but yeah, it's time to give this boss another go. Man, I I don't know. I, I did switch out, um, I switched out something for the Sorcerer's Emblem. I think it was the amulet that gives me increased, uh, inv in invincibility periods. Yeah, I think I switched that out. I'm pretty sure I did. Okay. I still, I still just feel like that the Genesis is not it. Not it for sure. Like, I should be using Elemental Ray. Okay. Yo, 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 yo. Yeah, like, this does so much damage, bro. So much. I don't think the wiki knows what it's talking about. <laughs> for sure. Okay, we'll heal. Even though I probably didn't need to. I wasn't really paying attention to my life at all. Okay, we're doing good. Oh, let's hit that. Yes. Oh, I got hit twice. Yes. Okay, we got a we got a lot of damage there from that. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're regenerating really quick. Which is good. 
Okay. Another one of these phases. Okay, these things kinda home. Like, just, oh, they have like a tad bit of homing. I've noticed that. When are they gonna disappear, though? Holy cow. Okay, that was good. We're doing so much better this fight. Jeez, I do not want to have to open up an area this big in the underworld, though. I can tell you that. That's going to be so much, so much of a pain. Ugh. I'm too close. Okay, we're good, though. We're good. Okay, we're now out to the, the holy donuts. Doing good. We're doing really good, actually. Okay. I don't think that uh, the holy donuts have contact damage too, which is really good. Okay, we just we just hit two life life thingies. That's really good, but we also just hit another one. Okay, we almost. Oh, that was close. I was not ready for that. We almost got it down. Okay. So now we can just, we should just be able to hit Providence. It's almost dead too. Oh my gosh, I'm going to do this. Uh, don't get cocky, kid. <laughs> I think that's a Devourer of Gods thing. It's either Devourer of Gods or Supreme Calamitous. One of the two. Yes, good. Okay. Yes. Yes! Oh, oh. Oh, yes! 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 Oh! Oh! My frames! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Oh! What is that? Okay. Oh, has been defeated. Cle Cle oh, I'm sweating. <laughs> oh. Calamitous beings have been inundated. Inundated? <laughs> what? Fossil life tree bark is bursting through the jungle's mud. Oh, so that's Eula Bloom. Oh my gosh. That fight, bro. That fight. Oh, we got the Elysian wings. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, I don't think I'm going to take on the underworld version. Oh my gosh, because that was actually so difficult. And honestly, I just kind of got lucky. But yeah, this is the setup here that I used. And it worked. And then I also just used the Elemental Ray to do damage to the boss. And then I switched to the Nuclear Fury to uh, do damage to the Holy Donuts. The Guardians, whatever. But yeah, holy cow. Okay, okay, let's go. let's go back home really quick. And we'll make these upgrades. So, I know for sure I can make the upgrades to the Elysian Tracers now, right? I, I'm or the Seraph Tracers, the Elysian Tracers. Oh no, that's that's post DOG. Dang it! And the Elysian rings are really good, right? Like, let's compare these two. Flight time is two forty. That's one forty. Mult or speed is two point seven. Man, <laughs> man. I don't know. I feel like I should, uh, I feel like I should just put the wings on, too. Oh, I can't. Oh, never mind, then. I'm not going to worry about it, because, jeez. Okay, so we'll definitely have to hold on to those for a while. I am, like, still shaking. Rune of Cause. Okay, so we will need this for the, uh, Devourer of Gods mini bosses things. Okay, let's trash all this. Okay. Providence, a core surrounded by stone and flame, a simple origin and a simple goal. What would have become of us had she not been defeated is a frightening concept to consider. Amen. Amen. Because I am still shaking from that fight. Holy cow. Okay, let's open this. Providence mask. Blazing core, equipable. The searing core of the profane goddess, 10% damage reduction. Being hit creates a miniature sun that lingers, dealing damage to nearby enemies. The sun will slowly drag enemies into it. Only one sun can be active at once. Okay. We got a summon weapon. Cool. We got a range weapon. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> and we got a melee weapon. So, of course. Of course. 
we're a mage, and we didn't get a mage weapon. Of course. So of course I'm going to have to fight that fight again. But hopefully we can make some upgrades really quick. Um, which I'm pretty sure we definitely can. Because of these divine geodes, they are material. And what do they make here? So that's for summoning developer item. 18 defense causes the star to fall and gives increased immune time with damage. Oh, so is this an upgrade? Oh, this is a direct upgrade to what I have. So, oh, but that's post DOG. Yarim. Um. Ooh, maybe I can make this. What is this? Temperature. Okay, so it's magic. So maybe then I should definitely make that. But then there's also Eulabloom stuff. Oh, and then there's an Elderberry. Okay, so that's Dark Plasma. Okay, so that's after Poltergeist. Ba Gast? Poltergast. Divine Retribution. I'm pretty sure that this is one that I need. I'm pretty sure that that one's really good. Okay, that's way later. Oh, I can make this right now. Let's make this. Uh, The Prince. Um, let's see here. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Okay, um, let's deposit these. Actually, we'll take one out. I'll deposit this. And then we'll make the prince. Prince. Yes. Uh, Castle Holy Fireball. Um, okay. We'll make it. Even though I probably won't be able to make anything else. Okay, that's fine. Let's get rid of these disappointing weapons, bro. Um, and then that's the only magic one I can make. Okay, so, let's go to the jungle and get some of this Eula Bloom ore. Actually, wait, no, really quick, let's test the damage on this thing. Okay, almost 10,000. And what's this? <laughs> okay, so maybe not as good. <laughs> but, I mean, I think it does home. I think that's the thing. Okay, really quick, also, there is an armor set I need, I need to get really quick. I don't need to make it, I have it. I made it last episode, and I can't remember what the heck the name of it is. Um, but I just made it. Astral? I think it was the Astral one. I'm pretty sure, because the reason why I need this was because this allows me to detect ores, so I don't need a Splunker Potion. And because I'm just mining, I shouldn't need the, um, the magic set. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, I also have the Summon, which by the way, looks ridiculously good. So yeah, I don't really know exactly what this looks like. But I should definitely recognize it when I see it. Or just like notice that it's different. <laughs> but I haven't seen it yet. Not, not, nada. I haven't seen anything. Gosh, my voice is still trembling from that stupid fight, bro. Okay, there's plenty of chlorophyte everywhere. I don't see it. Where is it? I mean, it is jungle, right? I'm pretty sure. It did say jungle, right? Yeah, jungle's mud. So maybe it's just like deeper somewhere. Where is it? That's it, right there. That's it. Okay. I'm gonna go get it really quick. It looks like there's some new enemies here. Oh, and they drop it. Cool. So let's just go this way very quickly. I just realized I have never made like an upgrade to this pickaxe. Maybe there just hasn't been one yet. But oh my gosh, bro. I'm... I am so happy I beat this boss. Okay, I'm going to gather some more of this ore, and I'll cut back when I'm done. Okay, guys, really quickly, I guess we can just make this tarragon, whatever it's called, but I think I first need to make the U... U I don't know how to spell this. Uh, bloom. Let's see here. Bloom. <laughs> here it is. Yes, I can make this. We'll craft a ton, just like this, and should be able to make now this tarragon armor. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Ter... No, ter... Uh, I don't know what it's called. Let's see here. Gone. Yes, here we go. Ter Terragon. Okay. So, there is a mage one. So, we are going to do that. We'll craft the mage one. And then there is a chest plate right here. Oh. <laughs> I need to get more geodes. Okay, well, unfortunately, guys, I'm out of time. So, I'm going to have to end the video here. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like the video if you guys enjoyed it. And also, subscribe for the next part. Because in the next part, I will finish making this Terragon armor. But I am going to do some hollowed Providence fights off camera. Um, and then I'm going to do the Underworld one tomorrow. And also, yeah, I did fight pirates while I was doing that. Cause, yeah, 
again, thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you guys all in the next video. Peace.